So I'm wandering the streets of Budapest. What a radiant, bustling city. I'm admiring the beautiful architecture, both old and new, nestled in this small country. So I'm thinking about an inspiration for chow time, maybe something sweet. So I think, oh, maybe a dobosh tort. No, don't want to attempt that. Maybe Napoleons. No, they do them best right here. So I finally decide, after going into a restaurant, that this is what I need to make. Hi, I'm Robin Bensley. Welcome to Chow Time. This is such an easy recipe to put together. Gotta have your noodles, of course. So, I have eight ounces of medium egg noodles. What I'm going to do is boil them for five minutes. No salt in the water. And five minutes is about three minutes less than the package calls for. But they're going to finish cooking off in the oven. So, five minutes. And in that short period of time, I'm going to put together the guts of the recipe. In a large bowl, put four tablespoons of melted butter, a half a pound of cottage cheese. I love the fact that there's cottage cheese in a dessert as well. Two eggs. We need some sugar and I'm going to use brown sugar so a half a cup of brown sugar. One teaspoon of real vanilla extract. And a teaspoon of ground cinnamon. I just want to mix all of that together. Noodles are ready, so we'll drain those. Don't rinse them. And we'll bring them over here and add them to all this wonderful flavor. The first time I ever had noodles for dessert was when I was a young girl. I had a friend who was Jewish and her mother made kugel, which is very similar to what this is. And I was just fascinated with the fact that there were noodles in my dessert. And I thought it was really wonderful. So it's not that I have it very often, but it was time. So I'm going to put this noodle mixture into an 8x8 eight eight buttered dish. Straighten it out a little bit. And then this goes in a 375 degree oven for about 40, 45 minutes. You want it to be golden on top. All right. There she is. See how nice and browned it is on top? Now here's the thing, you have to let it rest for about 15 minutes because it's best served slightly warm or room temperature. All right. Put a nice big piece there. And to finish it off, I like some lightly sweetened whipped cream. and a sprinkling 
of toasted almonds. I am still fascinated with the idea of eating noodles for dessert. Creamy, wonderful flavors, love the cinnamon, love the topping. And what's funny is, if I hadn't been wandering around Budapest, I would have never thought to make this. So there you go, food and travel, to me, go hand in hand.